Hi, I'm Joe from Annex Solutions. Behind me is our Annex setup, shade walls and awnings. Let me show you how we put this together. Today we're going to unroll the awning. So we undo the latches. First latches, side one on here, and then undo the thumb screw on the front awning. And then we go to the centre one. Some awnings have centre cradle arms, so this will be support as well as a cradle. So we undo the thumb screw, bring that down, releases that. And then we come over to this one, bring the lever down and then undo the thumb screw. Now every awning on the right hand side has a release mechanism. This one here is up the top there, the same as the rest of them. And then what we do is we grab the strap with your awning arm and then you bring the awning out. Now at this point what we do is we need to bring that strap to 12 o'clock. If you've gone over, then we need to release it to come back to that 12 o'clock position. So we release that mechanism there, we go up, and then by hand we bring that down. So that strap sits at 12 o'clock. Sometimes when we pull a rollout awning out, it's going to go too far all the way out. So what we need to do is we do need to take the tension off the barrel. So we get the barrel, we turn it, take the tension off, get another set of hands to flick the switch forward and then that takes that tension off and then the rollout awning goes back. Okay. After that we bring the crossbar over. That's the rear one and then we do the same with the front one as well. So that'll come up. Then we go back to the rear now what we do to the one side, we do to the other as well. So on this side here, we bring it up. So that'll sit there. Tighten up the thumb screw and then bring that arm away from the van. Now you can either have it close to the van or you can have it away from the van. So being away from the van is the carport mode. So we normally have it away from the van so you're not hitting your head when you've got it out. Now once this is like this, undo it again and then push that out. Now that'll be your lock in position. Again what you do to the front you do to the rear and then that will open up and you push that out again. Now that there is how to set up the awning ready to go. Today we're putting a rollout awning away, so what we need to do is you put your hand up the side here, undo the thumb screw, and then bring it back into the bracket on the van, bring the crossbar down, then this down to your locating points, then we do the same to the other side. Undo the thumb screw, arm into the bracket, down, crossbar, down. Okay, so what we need to do is when we're rolling this back up, so we need to take the tension off the barrel. So what we do with your strap, pull it down slightly, flick the switch, and then we roll it up. Close your latch thumb screw, tighten those back up so it's got the support when you're travelling, and then the latch on the front and the thumb screw as well. And that's it. So there's two ways you can have the awning. One is in a carport mode and the other one is to have the awning still attached to the van. So we're going to leave it attached to the van this time. So we've undone all the latches and the thumb screws, making sure that the support is away as well. Once we've undone the top latch, we grab the strap again, we pull it out. Now at this stage you can pull it pretty much all the way out if you want to. So what we do now is we pull the crossbar across on this one. Then we do the same with the front. So that'll come through. Then what we can do is we can raise this 
all the way up. So the same as the front, we can tighten that up, bring that out and have that out as well. So that's, you leave that attached to the van and then you don't have to take the arms away. 